I was chatting rubbish to, to, to Trent. Mm -hmm. He messaged me after and said, get home safely. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, after they had won 7 0. So you said you were at Dennis Bergkamp. Okay, but would you wear, for example, like a David Silva Valencia top? Oh, these are good <laughs> questions. Oh, Cavs, 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 well done. Well done. I don't know. It's a, it's a tough one because some people are just going to be like, no, I would never wear any rivals. So I think we're going to get laughed at this precise moment mm. because we are avid Man United supporters. Yeah. But we are wearing Real Madrid jerseys. But uh, listen, sometimes you just go, yeah, I mean, it's a nice jersey. But can bro. I be honest? I'm just going to put it out there. I'm just going to put it out there. Real Madrid mm -hmm. and Man United, we're brothers. Like, yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Well, there's, there's a mutual... Distant, distant there's, brother. There's, yeah, step brother. There's a mutual brothers. respect mm -hmm. from both teams. Now, mm -hmm. obviously, when we face each other, there's never, like, a hate towards each yeah, other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? I, I think of games where, you know, we beat Real Madrid when Ronaldo scored mm -hmm. a hat-trick 4-3. Yeah. That game for me... Legendary game. Legendary game. Mm -hmm. You know, Ronaldo scoring at yeah, Old Trafford. Yeah. <laughs> legendary game. You know what I mean? There's respect there. Even Ronaldo yeah. did the... Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? So, we're just showing some respect to mm -hmm. the club that, you know... We've got a lot of respect. Yeah. But also, there's a reason for this. There's a reason. There's and a the reason next for this. episode, you know why. We'll show why. Mm -hmm. Yeah, now nah, I'm saying. Mm -hmm. But yeah, my boy Cams is in the building right now. Come um, on. How you feeling? How you feeling? Feeling good, man. Feeling good. Excited for what we're gonna shoot today. Yeah. Um, and excited for the conversation we're gonna have because it's gonna it's completely it's not a breakdown or anything yeah. like that. People have, I'm sure by now you've you've taken in all the Arsenal City content, all of that type of stuff. One thing I'll say is Varane's retired. So big yes, shout out yes, to Varane, yes, you I know what a, I mean? I did a tribute to him on my Instagram. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That true solid CB was yeah, a bit crazy. That, that wasn't but, me that nah, said but that. But you still though. reposted it. No, so, but, nah, I, nah, no nah. but you see what my caption yeah, was? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's still uh, on your profile. Okay, but you've done <laughs> four weeks of some <laughs> crazy things here. I don't care, man. It's still on your profile. But other than that, you know, there's this there's, there's there's a topic I want to talk about that I've been asking a few friends, my brothers and stuff, and we've been going in on it for ages. So I want to ask you and see what your your take is on it. Yeah. So now, this is the question, right? Now, I want everyone in the comments to get involved. I want everyone that's watching everyone to, that's to really well. yeah listening as well get involved with this with your friends, whoever. Now the question is, could you wear? A rival player's national team kit. A rival player's national. So, oh. for example, would you? Can you wear a Phil Foden England top? Impossible. Impossible. That's impossible. Mm. Oh, that's impossible. Is it? Yeah. Oh, that's a good question. And do you know why it's impossible? Yeah, because I believe that, like, international side of things. Mm -hmm. We all come together, yep. all right? But we all have our favourites because those mm -hmm. favourites, if, if you if you support a team that, you know, um, a manager selected, mm -hmm. for a player from that team, sorry, then you're going to represent that player. Yep. But throughout most of the season, we are supporting our club. Mm -hmm. And nine times out of 10, that opposition player mm -hmm. is causing harm mm -hmm. to your club, mm -hmm. then also to your mental as well. Phil Foden, like, mad respect for the guy. I would never wear his jersey. Yeah. Every single English jersey I've ever worn, yeah. bar Michael Owen, because mm. I've got, I've got, yeah, I've got Michael Owen. Yeah, but he played for United anyway. No, but, but I've got when he was I've, Liverpool. I'm talking about that Liverpool. Ooh, but, there we go. This but, is what I wanted. No, no this but, is what I but, wanted. I'll, I'll give you the backstory to it. Yeah, so okay, okay. Like, 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 All right, but if, okay, it. but if Phil Foden said, "Yo, Harry, you're my guy. I've been watching you since I was younger. Here's my my top. Would, um, come to the Euro final." I wouldn't wear it. You wouldn't wear Phil Foden. And I know Phil Foden would know. Everybody knows, bro, that I'm a. I'm united over everything. <laughs> mm -hmm. Like I would, I couldn't do it. Yeah. Just because on a day to day basis, bro, Man City are man's ops. Okay. Same with Liverpool. Yep. Same with Arsenal. Same with Chelsea. Same mm -hmm. with Tottenham. Like Tottenham. So, I so you wouldn't wear a Harry. You wouldn't have worn a Harry Kane. No, in I wouldn't. Top. I, I would never. Yeah. I couldn't because it's like. Now I probably would because there we there. go. Now that's my second question. Because Lovely, yeah, but go. Let's stay on the first yeah, topic. Because yeah, because I just think when you're when, <laughs> like, 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 let's have it right. Let's have it right, Dan. And especially let's have it right. Yeah, you see when England's playing. Yep. You put everything aside. Like yeah, okay. everyone loves Saka. Everyone loves Kane. Mm. Everyone loves whoever. Mm -hmm. But when thirty-eight games of the season, bro. Yeah. That's that's our thing, and we love international football when mm -hmm. England's playing. But outside of that, I don't care. Yeah. But is it? 
is it does it come down to the individual is it because phil foden embodies man city for example like trent no. embodies liverpool so i couldn't wear you, trent so yeah Bro, no no you trent that? trent okay. is in, in, trent, that's what i'm yeah. saying trent, trent is done, impossible trent done this the other yeah well, no, i remember it's impossible. Yeah. so just to, just to show you why i couldn't yeah. do that as well yeah okay the individual players mm -hmm. they also hate united mm. as well they also hate their opposition mm -hmm. i was at um anfield when we lost seven nil right yeah. and at a touchline I was chatting rubbish to to, to Trent. Mm -hmm. He messaged me after and said, "Get home safely." <laughs> yeah. yeah, after they had won seven nil, <laughs> just to show you that it's de as much as it is ban off, yeah, it's yeah. serious. Mm -hmm. These men have grown up with Man United mm -hmm. being the best team in in, in England. Mm -hmm. Now we're not, mm -hmm. so it's now, bro. You you can't do that. See, but okay, but it you, sounds mad saying this. Us do Real Madrid. Yeah, yeah, no, but you, so that means so. But you would take a jersey from them, though. Out you would respect, frame a jersey. Of, You've got a Van Dyke jersey framed. Yes, out of respect for the player. Yeah, yeah? okay. Individual. Okay, on the Van Dyke the jersey, what does mm -hmm. it say? You never walk alone. Mm -hmm. I can't wear that. Yeah, yeah, Do you yeah. You know what I'm trying to say? But wearing it is like, a, that, I just think of what will last longer. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's like with ex-players, bro. Yep. Ex-players have jerseys of players mm -hmm. who they've had beef with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But when you're in the game and when mm -hmm. that player is, play, I can't wear his jersey. Yeah. And now... For me personally, yeah, I would wear like, it, it, I think for me it would have to be a player that is no longer playing in the Premier League. Now, see, this is where my next question. So, do you think, right, it's got to do with it being current players? So, for example, Foden's current Declan. You wouldn't wear Declan Rice. No, I don't. You wouldn't I've, wear these guys. I've got these jerseys. Yeah. I could never wear them. No. You wouldn't wear them, right? Is it because one, you are known as a Man United fan, for example, and two, is it because they are current players? So now let's take it back. Would you wear a Dennis Bergkamp Netherlands top? Okay. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. But you know, okay, so, 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 so. Got me. Got me. No, but okay. So with with the deck, uh, so with but Dennis Bergkamp, he Burkham, was a rival. He was he a was. rival. But he you inflicted. See, you see, you see, with Dennis Bergkamp, mm -hmm. I've always said, yeah, that's yeah. my my favorite Arsenal player okay. of all time. So there's a deeper meaning okay. behind yeah. that, right? But could but you wear it? I though? think if I was of this age. Mm -hmm. When I was watching football, when uh, say, say for example, I was this age when yeah. Dennis Bergkamp was playing for Arsenal, I wouldn't wear it. I think, but now, now, but now, but because he's retired, yeah, it's done. Like it's done. But I don't again. It? I wouldn't wear. But the, that means, but, you but would, I wouldn't wear Steven Gerrard. Yeah, uh, yeah, for I sure. I wouldn't wear Lampard. I wouldn't. Wear, I wouldn't wear Thier Thierry Henry. Would you wear Thierry Henry? I wouldn't. Top? I wouldn't. If the France 1998, Zidane, you know me. France top was there, Zidane. and he said Henry. Zidane. No, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Zidane. <laughs> Zidane's not a rival. If a France 1998 Thierry Henry top was there, you would not wear it. I wouldn't. But you'd wear Dennis Bergkamp. I would wear Dennis Bergkamp. See, this is what I mean. So it's, so it's down to the individual. It's down to the individual. And also, it's down to, for me, like, Dennis Bergkamp, as much as he was an Arsenal player, mm -hmm. yeah, he wasn't someone that possessed that hate. Mm -hmm. You didn't have no hate for him. Mm -hmm. Someone like Thierry Henry, Patrick, Patrick yeah. Vieira, mm -hmm. Tony Adams... Mm -hmm. Um, Perez, Perez, Will Tord. Mm. These players have got moments in their careers where they were disrespecting, mm. so to speak, Man United. Mm. So for me, I couldn't wear, I couldn't wear the, I couldn't wear an Aguero one because mm. what yeah, Aguero stands uh, yeah, for no, as well. Aguero. I couldn't do that. Steven for Gerrard. example, could you wear? Uh, now see, this is the next one. Like in a way, so could you wear Steven Gerrard? And that is, is obvious. That's mm. just too much. You can never wear Steven Gerrard and stuff. But so you said you wear a Dennis Bergkamp. Okay, but would you wear? For example, like a David Silva Valencia top. Oh, these are good <laughs> questions. Oh, Cavs, 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 well done. Well done. All right, okay. So, this is another one as well. A vintage David Silva 2004 Valencia top. Okay, now, now, now you've asked some good questions mm. because David Silva, Valencia, that's a moment in time. That's there a moment go. in time. That's like retro kit. Retro, it's like. It's a respect to him as mm -hmm. an individual. But now, he's also, but man, he's a rival. He's got a statue. He's a rival. The now, there's a reason why I haven't worn it. I probably, I, I would, ha I would have the shirt mm. signed and have it in my house mm -hmm. framed because, but then I wouldn't because I'd probably have the Man City one framed because mm -hmm. that for me was the best error of him. I'll probably mm -hmm. have, yeah, I'll probably have that or again the Spanish jersey. Yeah, but I wouldn't wear it. Mm. I think wearing a jersey, an international jersey, because this goes back to the original question, yeah? Mm -hmm. Wearing an international jersey of a player that plays uh, for a club that mm -hmm. is a, ri a direct rival to your club, I think it's crazy. Okay. But I do think international side of things, yeah. it makes it a little bit more digestible because yeah. this is for your country. Mm -hmm. 
But to answer your question about David Silva, I probably wouldn't wear it. Just you wouldn't wear it. No, I, I would yeah. only wear I would only wear jerseys, and this is just me being because yeah. I've never done it before, so yeah. I'm, I'm speaking off my own experience. I would only wear jerseys of players that have not been a direct rival to my team. But does it then come down? Does it then come down to as we mentioned? It comes down to the individual. But then does it then come down also to what nation, for example, they represent? So f because for example. If there's a player that's from a niche nation, so for example, me, yeah? Mm. I'm not saying Nigeria is niche, but we don't have as many stars as France and mm. all these teams, Spain. I would have won a John Obi Mikel Nigeria top while mm. he played for Chelsea. Fair. He's our biggest player. But but okay. He's would, our biggest player. I can't, you, he's, our, you, he's, he's our all right, national so treasure. Was, so if he was from Ivory Coast. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Would you have worn a Didier Drogba shirt? If I'm a Man United fan. Yeah. And if I, yes. So you I wouldn't would. have looked at the fact that Didier Drogba is is generally how though that's your country's greatest. I, I, I know your I, greatest player. That's your niche country. So that's like basically saying a Barcelona fan that's um, Colombian can't wear James Rodriguez. Like come no, on, but, that's okay, their like I, I that's think, their that's their star. I think there's levels to it because <clears throat> James Rodriguez is not Radamel Falcao. Yeah. I think when we're speaking no, I about... I think he might even be... Uh, yeah, nah, I think man. they might see him as like, like, goal, James Rodriguez, know? obviously, an incredible... Mm -hmm. um, he had an incredible World Cup, yeah? Mm. And obviously that allowed him to go to Real Madrid, right? But Falcao, we're looking at one of the best strikers mm. in Europe. At, at so you don't time. think a Real Madrid fan could wear... I don't a, think a Colombian Deepa, Real Madrid bro, fan okay. couldn't wear look at uh, the, Radimel look Falcao at like top. I don't know. A, 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 pig's head, a pig's head was thrown... Mm. Was thrown... Yeah. At Luis Figo. Yeah. That should show you a, enough yeah. alone how crazy it is. Now, where I think it gets a bit techy is because with Man United and Man mm -hmm. City, yeah, Tevez. Mm -hmm. No, that's impossible. Did you get what I'm trying yeah, to say? Would you wear a Tevez jersey? Impossible. Exactly. Impossible. So, but that's what it's, it's, it's what, circumstantial. Yeah, it's circumstantial. Now, I would wear Andy Cole jersey even though he's played for Man City. Yeah, because I would wear Shamichael mentioned... jersey because he's even though he's played for Man City. Yeah, yeah. Because I know that he's prime years yeah. were at Man United mm -hmm. and it's not like he wanted to leave mm -hmm. he got sold mm -hmm. so there's a difference but right now we're wearing Real Madrid tops you're yeah. wearing a Rudiger Real Madrid top signed one yeah <laughs> a Rudiger signed Rudiger Real Madrid top mm. he was a Chelsea player yeah but you're repping it because he's Salone yeah, because he's my. This and is again, what I'm and saying, I think, so now. what you're saying, you get yeah, what yeah. I'm saying. No, I, I hate, but I think, now you get it. But if there was 50 Sierra Leone players, yeah, that were all playing in the top mm -hmm. top leagues, mm -hmm. I don't think I'd be wearing a Rudiger shirt right now. Mm -hmm. I think it's because, like what you said, going off the fact that Nigeria, John Obi Mikel, when he was playing, mm -hmm. he was our star man. He was your star man. Yeah. Now let's take it back to back in the day mm -hmm. when there was JJ Okocha, yep. Lee George, Teribo West. Mm -hmm. Like these, there was so many players. Now mm -hmm. all of those players were playing for, let's say, one of them was playing for Arsenal. Yeah, yeah. One yeah. of them was playing for Man United yeah. or Liverpool or whatever, right? Mm -hmm. I think it would have been a bit different. But it's the same. Okay, it, or you can say that for Kanu. No, like would you wear a Kanu jersey? I would have worn a Kanu jersey, yeah. But you know that deep Nigeria down, Kanu deep, jersey, down yeah. deep down, you know. It's a bit mad because yeah, he played for Arsenal. But then I'm Nigerian, like so. So, so you're saying then? I think it your also country comes before your club, because if that's in the case, cer in certain cases, I would say, yeah. Now look, I'm yes, I'm from England, but I'm not like English. I'm, I, I, I classify myself as Nigerian. So even when it comes to like wearing national tops, I would wear, I've worn Germany tops, I've worn France tops, I've worn, mm. I would never wear another African country's top. Mm. Like you'd never see me walking same. around wearing same. Ivory Coast or same. Ghana or anything. You'll never see me do that. You're saying same yeah. as well. But I'd wear different, in European teams, I would wear different but, South American And that American comes teams. down to it being a direct yeah. rival with your country what, or your club. African team. Yeah. yeah. So you you know that Ghana, Nigeria, mm -hmm. um, Egypt, mm -hmm. Algeria, Morocco, yeah. um, these are the yeah, best yeah. teams, countries, sorry, Cameroon, sorry, that, Cameroon yeah. in Africa, right? Mm -hmm. You are Nigerian. Mm -hmm. You wearing, you would never wear, would you wear Samuel Eto'o top? Barcelona one? No, Cameroonian one. No, no, no. Okay. I would never wear any other African country. That's top. my point. Yeah. I, 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 Sierra Leone don't have that quality mm -hmm. of players. Yeah. And Rudiger doesn't even play for Sierra Leone. Yeah. But his heritage is from Sierra Leone. Yeah, that's a good point. Right? He's German. Mm -hmm. I would wear a German Rudiger shirt mm -hmm. because Rudiger's my my boy. Yeah. So I would wear that. But, but he's then a Chelsea player, former Chelsea. A former, yeah, and that's why I said. But it's what I'm saying. I, I would only wear like he's Real Madrid. Look at me, mm -hmm. yeah. Real Madrid are brothers. <laughs> Do you know what I'm trying to say? I just I couldn't wear 
a direct right like mm. for example like I hear what you're saying Rudiger played for Chelsea yeah. and I wouldn't have worn a Ru I would never wear a Chelsea jersey I would never yeah, wear yeah, any other course. jersey I've never worn mm. a Premier League jersey yeah. of a club that's not mine mm -hmm. I've never ever done that so mm -hmm. that takes that out of the way but when you speak about individuals mm -hmm. I think that's when it gets a bit techy. that's the thing like I think there's special circumstances of everyone because for example I do think I'd wear a Thierry Henry 98 hot top Mm. I think I would wear a Thierry I could Henry. never. I could never. But you would wear Dennis Burke. It's the like you said. You said, you said. You said um, Holland. Yeah, I'd I, wear said, a Holland I, said, one. I said France. Though I said France. Okay, that's that's I fair. Wear, whoa, I would never wear Thierry. Yeah, yeah. Arsenal I couldn't. Top. Yeah, no, no, no. That, no, like, that's impossible. I'm talking then, about then the. But the, okay, think of it. Or, yeah. or, before, or for example, let's say as I said, David Silva before he got there. Or okay, cool. Would you wear a Yaya Toure Barcelona top? Nah. You see Yaya Toure, bro, yeah? <laughs> yeah but this Generally, I, I would probably wear... Yeah, I wouldn't. You wouldn't? I wouldn't. I just think about it because then I think, as an African, I wouldn't wear his Ivory Coast top. Mm. I would want the top. Yeah. Like, with me, I, I like to get signed shirts yeah, just for because sure, for out of, sure. out of sick, what, what they've done for the game. Yeah. And I love it, like, you know what I'm trying to say? But as a Man United fan, to wear Yaya Toure, knowing that, like, he was part of the problem mm -hmm. and part of the reason why Man United yeah. stopped being successful. Yeah. I couldn't do that. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I'm saying? It's like, oh, hey, you've dunked on us. Yeah. You know, I'm not, I, I couldn't do that. Yeah. So I think it, for me, it comes down to, are you a direct rival of my mm -hmm. club? Are you currently playing for that club? Yeah. If you are, then no way. Yeah. Also, if you're not a direct rival to my country, mm -hmm. but like England, I wouldn't wear a, a Wells Gareth Bell top. You wouldn't? Nah. You would wear a good one. I wear a Real Madrid top. one. So you wouldn't wear Wales, Gareth Bale? No, I couldn't. Because that's, that's man's direct. Scotland, I wouldn't mm. wear a McTominay one. Yeah, no, I wouldn't, I wouldn't wear a, a Roy Keane's uh, Irish top. Mm. I wouldn't. I wouldn't do it. You wouldn't wear a Roy Keane Ar Ireland? No, I wouldn't. I couldn't, bro. Because, now, so to be fair, no, because, I hear that. Ireland, the whole GB thing, yeah, no, I hear that. Like, it's, just, it's a tough, it's, it's, it's tough, you know, this question. Is so you definitely, so for example, okay, you said the thing with Vieira front. You know what's killing me? Cam's is proper trying to find a loophole. No, there, I'm yeah. telling you, no, I'm not playing devil's yeah, yeah, advocate. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because for me, like, where I stand on this is I would not wear a current player's national top. Mm -hmm. No way. A current rival's national top. Yeah, I'd even ask you. But there is exceptions. For example, Thierry Henry. Mm. I would wear a Thierry Henry France top. You know, I would. And then, so there is some certain kind of ex what's the rule like um exceptions to the rule that i would do for when it comes to their legends when it comes to their legends now the part that i'm completely 50 50 on not 50 50 but i don't know is the players who became legends of rival play clubs but before they became legends so for example as i said the david silva valencia thing mm. now i don't think i'd wear david silva valencia but would i'm trying to think of I'm trying to think of some legends that I played. Like, Drogba Marseille. Like, would I not? I wouldn't wear Drogba Marseille. But where, okay, where like, I it? Don't, I don't know. I might wear Drogba Marseille. I can't lie. I'll be honest. David Silva, because the reason why, because there's something about City that's so annoying because they're neighbours and also how they came up when we declined. So there's something that's, I'm very, dis, I got a distaste mm. for them. But like, Drogba Marseille. I think I would. Impossible in Liverpool. No, Liverpool is yeah, not you're even done. Yeah, Liverpool, Liverpool is not done. even. A, I, let me ask you, Archie. Liverpool Archie's in the back, yeah. And, and if you can't hear him, we'll say what he says. Yeah, would you wear Wayne a, Rooney England? Wayne Rooney England. Yes. And, and why would you wear it? Uh, oh, I don't know. You know. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> My initial answer was yes. Yeah. See. Because I think he didn't really do much for England. Nah, you know what? I'm, I'm going back. I'm saying no. no. Would you wear Not David David Beckham? Because you've got a yeah, signed David Beckham David jersey. Beckham. Okay, so why would you wear David Beckham? Knowing Ooh, that, Beckham good one. personally has gone beyond just football. That's like less. That feels like less of a rivalry. Where Rooney felt personal with mm. Arsenal, whereas Beckham never felt massively personal with Arsenal. Can they hear this? I don't know. We'll find out. All right. So, so basically, Archie has yeah. said that he would wear the. And Archie's an Arsenal fan. He said he would wear a David Beckham because if he feels that Beckham is more than just football, it's yeah. an iconic step. And I hear that. Mm. I think there's certain players that are just like, mm. an, like you said, an exception, right? But that's still a Man United legend. Yeah. That's a Man United. And that's class and that's ninety two. When, when Arsenal and Man United were going head to head, mm -hmm. Beckham was an integral he part was in of that. Peak. That was his prime of his powers. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Maybe a, for England, he was so mm. iconic. Like yeah, me, yeah. I, I separate the two. Would you? 
on. Where a Rio Ferdinand England top. <laughs> there we go. No. Hold so, on. So, so, yeah, yeah. We why are not. We are Rio Ferdinand. You would wear a Rio. Would you wear a Rio Ferdinand England top? No. Ooh. Archie says no. Archie says no. <laughs> yeah, and because Ooh. why? Why? Because he represents <laughs> yeah. your rivals. Yeah. You're that mm. bro. You see rivalries, yeah. Yeah? yeah. Remember, like. We was going to speak about Man City and Arsenal right mm -hmm. now. Yeah. That that last game that they had has just reignited mm -hmm. whatever we thought was a little, you know, it's, yeah. not a, it's a rivalry. Yeah. There's things being said. Now, I know when this is all said and done, you would never wear a, a Haaland jersey. Never. Mm, yeah. He just told you, Arteta, yeah. humble yourself yeah, and yeah. threw the ball at um, um, mm -hmm. Gabriel's head. Bro, it's just started a rivalry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, okay. I love Vieira. I mm -hmm. think he's an incredible player. Yeah. For what you've I done, could not, I could never wear. I, I could, would if I couldn't wear Vieira because I feel like I'm snaking. I'm, sna I'm snaking. I'm snaking. And you know you and Keane yeah. got a good relationship yeah, you know now. What I'm saying? Well, you know what I'm saying? So it's oh, like, but oh, what? Ian Wright. Would you wear Ian Wright? Oh! <laughs> would you wear an Ian Wright England jersey or an Ian Wright Crystal Palace jersey? Okay. Because of who Ian is, Ooh. because it, like, like I would take all the flack here. Yeah. Actually, Crystal Palace is a prem team, so let me say yeah. England. Yeah, would you no, wear no. Ian Wright? Because you wouldn't wear another prem team's top. No, really. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. So I would wouldn't. you wear Ian Wright? Yeah, England. I would. I would. I would. There we go. I would, see, I would. see this? Do you see what I'm saying? But it's circumstantial. This it's always circumstantial. Saying, because bro. Ian Wright, I think it's the same as what Archie said. Yeah, yeah. Ian Wright's more than football. But is he? He Ian Wright, he's uh, he embodies Arsenal. Bro. No, but he does. He's still he there. Does. He does, but doing adverts. No, but do you know what? See with Ian Wright, yeah. I remember being a young black kid, yeah. Okay. And, and having Ian Wright as a poster of "I'm not here for nonsense." Yeah. And still being able to be re respected as a elite goal scorer. Yeah. Won a Premier League. Done it late in his career. So mm -hmm. he's, I think his journey, like he reminds me, yeah, of. The, uh, the another story that I'm really in like in touch with mm -hmm. is like Jamie Vardy's story. Mm -hmm. It's coming from nothing yeah, yeah, yeah. to something. Mm -hmm. That's why we all love Jamie Vardy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even though he scored against all of our clubs, yeah. there's something about Jamie Vardy's it's story love, yeah. that we love. Then on top of that, they're elite goal scorers. So mm -hmm. I think that's the reason why. And Ian Wright is again is someone that's unks, bro. Like yep. you saw the love he showed yeah, to yeah, us. Yeah, like yeah. you get me. It's it's, it's difficult for though. me to not be. Oh, what a question? Mm. So yeah, I, I would probably that would be the one that people would be like, why are you wearing an Ian Wright yeah, jersey? Yeah. And I'd be like, bro, it's deeper than that. Mm. Like it's deeper than just the football. Where is Ian Wright vintage Arsenal jersey? Never, never. He that's a that's a jersey that I would want to get signed. Yeah, but I would never wear it because You'd never wear it. That time it's just remember I'm I'm. I'm gonna know what you're gonna say after yeah. this. I'm 33. Yeah. Come on, continue. Okay. Continue. I'm 33. Yeah. <laughs> continue. So, so when I when I started watching football properly was like 97, 98, mm -hmm. and that's when Arsenal won the league, innit? Yeah. I remember Nell Carr. I remember Vieira. I remember yeah. all of those players, and I remember, wow, this is the best team in England at mm -hmm. the moment, right? Then we had to work hard. I remember all the games at Highbury and Old Trafford. Like yep. there was a real rivalry. The reason why we hate Arsenal fans mm. is because of that. Mm. So to then wear a jersey of a player, yep. it has to be genuinely worth it. Mm. And Burkamp, I wouldn't even wear his jersey, but I'd wear a, a, a Holland jersey because mm. I remember '98 World Cup when we lost to Argentina. Yep. I wanted Holland to win so badly mm. because I felt like Argentina were the team that we we got robbed because mm. of Simeone's yeah, yeah. Uh, antics. Yeah. And that goal, that but I, I was celebrating that. Yeah. And I loved Bergkamp as a football mm -hmm. player. So, yeah. See, it's, 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 that's what I'm saying. With this, yeah, it's mad, like, it's so circumstantial to the case because there's some that you would, there's some that you wouldn't. I don't know. It's a, it's a tough one because some people are just going to be like, no, I would never wear any rivals. I mean, not, not in, in any instance. All right, would you rivals. wear... They'll just say they wouldn't. I'm trying to think of a player that because I I, for, I was gonna say Iron Robin for for a second, mm. yeah. Because Iron Robin, even though at Real Madrid and at Chelsea, yeah. I think Chelsea was his, was better than Real Madrid. Bayern yeah, Munich was, yeah, was, 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 was when he yeah. was a different player, mm. yeah. Would you wear a Bayern Munich Robin jersey? Yeah. Yep. And why would it, why would you wear that? Because I don't see Iron Robin as somebody that embodies Chelsea. You know what I mean? I just see him as. Would he, you wear he Kevin De Bruyne Wolfsburg jersey? Impossible, jersey. impossible. I can't. He embodies Man City. That guy's gonna get a statue outside the club. But Wolfsburg That's, though. No, but he's gonna get a statue outside City. But Wolfsburg. Me walking around. But you know, you know, <laughs> you, you know, absolutely. But you know, you know yeah. that Kevin De Bruyne. Are, yeah. When he was at Wolfsburg, mm -hmm. the form. Yeah. Is the reason why he's at Man City now. Mm -hmm. Like he, that was a. Yeah. That was him cooking. Yeah. Right. And he come to Premier League and done a mad thing. It's got nothing. That's Wolfsburg jersey. Yeah. It's got absolutely nothing. But to that's do the same with David Silva at Valencia. 
So that means you would wear no, David Silva. I, I wouldn't. No, I would not. Oh, what's the styrene oh, about? Hold on, hold on, hold on, what's no, the no, styrene no. about? I would not wear a KDB or David Silva top at, at, at any club. Nah, I wouldn't. But this is a good one. Would you wear Sas Fabregas? Spain. Oh, man. Come See, on, this is the man. thing. There's certain players that I feel like just fall into a weird... But you know, he played for Chelsea and Arsenal. But would you wear a Spain 2008 Cesc Fabregas top? You've just made me think about, yeah, <laughs> everything I've said for the last half an hour. And you've now doubted Yeah, because Cesc Fabregas, exactly yeah. exactly what it does. It, uh, but do you know why I couldn't? And I wouldn't. You wouldn't? You know why I Are wouldn't? Are you sure you wouldn't? Or are you no, just saying that? No, mother's career. The reason why I wouldn't, mm -hmm. even though he didn't, he didn't mean it, he threw a pizza at Salas Ferguson. Yeah, yeah. In he his face. It, in his face. Yeah. He, in, in, right, in his, right in his noggin. Like, he, he done that. So, mm -hmm. it's like, there's there's history. Like, Spain, we, we loved watching Spain. Mm -hmm. And even when England was knocked out of tournaments, you know, you wanted Spain to win. Yeah. Because it's like, they play in the best football right yeah. now, yeah? But then Sass Fabregas, like you said, for Arsenal <coughs> and for Chelsea, mm -hmm. direct rival. Mm. If he didn't do what he did, that pizza, I probably would have... You probably would have an exception. I probably would have, innit? But mm. I, I think I'm sticking to my, my reality and what's happened. I've mm. never wore another um, country's jersey mm -hmm. before, ever. Like, I've like always never. No, never. As in, like, what do you mean never country's jersey? Like, I've never... any. Like, I've got a, a Kia Keys, yeah, sent me yeah. a... Um, a Holland jersey mm. from when they won the um you never wore the Euros. No, but it's got Pinero on the back. Oh, okay, cool, cool. So, oh, no, no. So you've worn a national, a national team, but not a name. Not a name, not a name okay, on, yeah, it, yeah, on, yeah. on the back, right? Because yeah. the jerseys look good, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I, I, I don't think I could wear a Fabregas one. That's that's He threw a pizza at mm. mm. bro. Like, mm. it's just, there's just certain things you couldn't do. Like, for example, Martin Keown. I could yeah, never yeah, wear a jersey. No, no, what you no. done to Van Nistelrooy? Yeah, yeah, never. Like, never. Ashley Cole. I couldn't wear an Ashley Cole jersey either. Like, you are part of a... Deep on yeah, yeah, yeah. hatred. But see, the thing is, with the Spurs ones, though, I don't include Spurs in this. Now I, I don't do. include. Now I, I do. don't include Spurs. Like, <clears throat> I would wear a. Van, oh, no, no. I would wear a Van der Vaart. I would wear a Belgium. I would Belgium. wear. I would wear a Gareth Bale. Top. I, I, I would wear. Not Sp no, not Spurs. Gareth Bale. I would wear a Roman Jin Belt top. Yeah, yeah. I'd wear. I, a, I, I'd said, wear yeah, yeah. A, a Wells, maybe not, but I'd wear Roman. I'd wear a Belgian Musa Dembele top. This is what I'm saying. Yeah, because so Spurs, I don't include them. Because they're not really our rivals, yeah. but they are part of the bunch yeah. of of teams that it was a top. It's, a, it's still to this day. We got yeah. them. We got them next. It's, yeah. it's a top game to watch mm -hmm. in the Premier League, but it's not. There's no real history behind it in terms of like beef. Yeah. Or title. Yeah. Like we yeah. lost the title to Spurs. Mm -hmm. or, like we've lost the title to Chelsea. We've lost the title to Man City. Yeah. We've lost the title to Arsenal. Yeah. We've 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 lost big games mm -hmm. to Liverpool. Yeah. So there's a there's something there in it, but yeah, I think it's very circumstantial. I personally, like Real Madrid, even though we're saying all this and mm. wearing Real Madrid jerseys, yeah. yeah, I look at Rudiger. Like I said, it's different. Yeah, there's some that will that will transcend, but then that's the thing. Obviously, you have got a lot of friends in football as well. Mm. So how does it work in terms of friendships? Is is there like a line? Do you gonna come from? There's like in the terms of friendships, like. Because honestly, for ex if 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 Decker's gave me an England rice top, I don't know. I might wear it, bro. I can't lie. I might wear it. I, I, now I wouldn't wear it out because I don't have time to explain to people why you wearing Declan Rice. I wouldn't do that. Mm. But like, if I'm just in, you say you said you're having a watch party for England game, and Declan Rice gave me an England. But all I'll do rice is take a picture I, I and might. use it. I use it again. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, but, yeah I'll do a slide one. Got him. But that's the thing. I might because you're like. You're cool with the person. Yeah, I, I, again, I, I think relation. Like, I'm sure. Yeah, most. But most well, actually, don't let, have let us know in the, the comments players. if there's anyone, uh, or, or if you if you're listening to this as well, yeah. let us know on our TikTok or whatever. Um, there must be some some people that support clubs. Yeah, that their friends or are play for are, a club. Are, no, play against. Yes. So let's say, for example, you support Man United. Yeah. But your best friend is John Stones. Yeah. Now, John Stones is your good friend. You've known him for years. There we go. Ooh, I love this. Do you wear John Stones' shirt mm. because he's invited you to a final? And yeah. it might not even be against your team. It he's could invited be against you to the box. The in box, a box, yeah. At and all, the all, all of his family are wearing John Stones', Stones jersey. Yeah. But it's against, I don't know, let's say Arsenal in the, in the Champions League final. But you support Man United. Do you wear that jersey? Let's say it's your friend. Do you mm. wear that jersey? Wow. 
Because I know nah, I could not wear I, I couldn't wear man. So you're the only so. one Like he said to you Cam's Bro I'll be like bro You're my brother You should know me bro I can't yeah, but I can't, like, wear, bro, like, I can't wear Like Cam's Man look, City top bro You're my guy bro You've yeah. been there from the beginning <laughs> We trained together mm. You had an injury You didn't make it And I said mm. I've got you for life mm. It's now my first ever Champions League final My mum's here my, my wife's here My kids are here My dad's here You have to be here we're all wearing they're all wearing John Stone's jerseys. Come on, man. Do you know what's good? Do you want to ask a quick question? Because one of my closest friends is very close friends with Raheem Sterling, for example. Mm. And he's an Arsenal fan, but he always used to wear Liverpool gear because mm. Raheem would send it to him. Mm. And he would wear it in the box, Sterling, 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 their tops. So I mean Liverpool and Arsenal not like that, well, they're becoming it, but like, you know, they're still rivals, but Nah, I couldn't wear a city one. That's too far. So you're, so, so you're going to tell your mate? Nah, no, I'll tell him, no, yeah, I'll tell him no. Fez. I'll tell him no. What about you? Hell no. You say no, that's what I'm saying. Hell I'll tell no. him no. Like, it, it, it just goes beyond, like, and then I know that, okay, cool. Let's say you lose the final. Yeah. And man, I'm just, just wearing the man. I'll just take that shit off, Yeah, man. you know what I'm saying? I'll take that shit off. And just walking around wearing your, your jersey. I'd, I'd, nah, I couldn't. I couldn't. But it's an interesting question. It's an interesting question. No, it is. It's, it's a phenomenal question it's and Jesus. well done. Mm. I think that, that question, <laughs> I could have been chatting for time. Bro. Like, like, like we said, Cam said, um, let us know in the comments as well. Let me ask, sorry, just a quick one. Yeah. So basically, I, when I asked my boy, so for example, two perfect examples, yeah. Liaz is Algerian. Mm -hmm. Liaz has an Algerian Mares top. Mares mm -hmm. is a city legend, pretty much. In all kind of, it was a city great. That taps into what we're saying, though. Mm. When we so look at niches. when we look at England, mm -hmm. France, uh, Brazil, mm. the, the 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 nations that are considered the best teams in the mm. world, right? They have year by year yeah. there are multiple top players that play yeah. for the club, right? Mm -hmm. uh, country, sorry, Mares is the poster boy for yeah. Algerian football, mm -hmm. right? And he will be for a long time until mm. someone else comes in, right? When you think of Mares, if no matter what club you could be a diehard rival, mm. whatever, that man is the reason why you could potentially win anything, mm. right? So I get the sentiment behind it. Mm -hmm. Similar to what you was basically saying. Yeah. Now, if Rudiger played for Sierra Leone, mm -hmm. I would wear every single Rudiger jersey. Because yeah. you're, my, you're like, outside of the club you played yeah. for, you're my guy. It's like Korea fans with Son. Yeah, that they they are all Spurs fans now. Yeah, yeah, literally. Like, like, I'm not like, saying I'll convert. Club, it's like Park Ji-sung, yeah. bro. When he was yeah. at United, bro, yeah. the whole reason why we was doing our tours in South yeah, Korea yeah. was because of Park Ji-sung. Yeah, like he is a a, a national hero. Mm. So that is a difference. It, it, There's a difference towards like we've had in England. Yeah, it was split great, between so. Chelsea, Liverpool, Arsenal, Man United. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and Newcastle with mm. Alan Shearer. Right now. We hated Liverpool. Mm -hmm. We also hated Chelsea, and we also hated Arsenal. Mm -hmm. So, and it was vice versa. So, nobody on planet Earth mm -hmm. that was any of those fans would wear any of Their those rivalries. Shows. There's, There's no reason to because be you have plenty of options. And as also, well. there was also other players mm -hmm. that played for the teams that couldn't even make the team. We're talking mm -hmm. about your Nicky Butts. Mm -hmm. yeah, We're talking yeah, about your Lee sure. Dixons. Yeah, like Jody Morris. Mm -hmm. Like they they couldn't play for the for England. Mm -hmm. But they were also part of the the hate. That, yeah, that, yeah, that yeah. Each fan had yeah. so it. And my boy, my boy is a Juve fan, right? Mm. So he's from Italy. He's a Juve fan. I asked him this question and he was like, it's tough because he was like, he would never wear like a Maldini, Totti, um, Nesta tops, but he would wear R9. And R9 played for Inter and Milan. Yeah. But he would, and he said that, and he wouldn't even wear a Zlatan Juve top because mm. Zlatan- Played for everyone. Not even that, Zlatan only acknowledges Milan now, mm. pretty much. He doesn't really acknowledge Inter and, and Juve. Mm. So it just shows how much it comes down to the individual. Mm. Do you get come from? I, I think, think every I single think person would wear a R9 shirt. I think yeah. every single person. I also think every single person would wear a Ronaldinho shirt. Mm. I think that- I think look, there's some people, I, that's what I think. I think Henri's in that boat. I think he, he transcends he, it. Yeah, he does, he does. But I just think Henri, like, again, but, that's, like, that's someone who's just like, I speak of Henri. Like he's like so he played Arsenal. for my club. He's so awesome. Yeah, he is awesome. Like, but it's like, let's have it right. He's Thierry, bro. Like he was an icon. He's an icon. He's Thierry. And I'm just talking about his French kit. I'm not even talking about his Arsenal kit. And you know what? A lot of people don't give him the respect that he deserves for France. It's because like, he didn't really have big moments. That's yeah, but I think in the Euros, when they won it, highest goal scorer. Yeah, it was in group stage, though, innit? But still, it it's like Henri is a. Uh, in the uh, final, it's man of match, though. He's Again, good in the like, like, he's but, scored, but, he's good. but my point is with Henri, yeah. I think like he's done everything in football, yeah, yeah, yeah. It? like everything, can it? 
Like whether or not you want to say he won the Champions yeah, League yeah, yeah. with Barcelona, still won it, mm. right? Um, and he is uh, someone that like, even though he's still fit, like bro, put it this way. Mm. This is the best way to explain. When Henri came back mm -hmm. and scored against Leeds. I celebrated. I, I got goosebumps and I celebrated. Yeah, I celebrated. Because it wasn't about Arsenal it's anymore. Different. No, it's no, about no. It's you, about the man. It's Henri, about the man. I remember that number 12. Then I remember yeah. him again scoring against Sunderland. Yeah. That's the, I think that's the, the game it's that gave game. them the Champions League, mm -hmm. that allowed them to play in the Champions League. Like, I'm a Man United mm -hmm. fan and I, and I felt something, yeah, bro. Yeah, bro, nah, I still go back and watch it sometimes. Goosebumps. It's emotional, bro. Goosebumps. It's emotional, it's not even my team, bro. Bro, so, so I think still. Henry could be, you know? Mm. He could be he the could little, cover, yeah. you know what I mean? Like, he might get a little, a little and, and he was number 12 for France, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He might get a little time. Not even a 14. Hey, listen, let's leave that to the people anyway. Yeah. I want to know what you guys think. I remember the three, I asked him three questions. Think about the three questions that I asked. What would you guys do in them positions? They're players that are exceptions to the rule. Are you just straight? You'll never do it. Are you okay with it? And this actually all stemmed from, um, I saw something which is about three um, in the preseason, which I think was kind of foul, but I didn't think they should be like putting on the internet. Basically it was the preseason Emirates Cup. And in some lady, I think it was, was wearing a Foden England top to the game, but she's an Arsenal fan. Mm. And everyone, they took a picture and were like, fuck off, like mm. game's gone type thing. So then I don't know why it just hit me yesterday. I just had it just came to me yesterday, mm. and I was like, "Let me ask this question." Like, good question. So that's man. where that's where it stems from. But yeah, you guys, let me know what you guys think. Let us know, man, because I'm actually looking forward to seeing people's responses. Hundred percent. Okay, I've got a question. All right, All right. I, I I had to summon it in last second. Yeah, I think you should get this one. Okay. Can you name me the top ten foreign goal scorers in Premier League history? Aguero. Yep. Uh, Luis Suarez. Nope. No way. Nah. And you got two minutes. It's 10 past two oh, right okay. now. Oh, okay. Um, Giroud. Nope. Damn. <laughs> Foreign goal scorers. Um, wow. Van Nistelrooy. Nope. Haaland. Nope. What? <laughs> In Premier League history? Yep, yep. Thierry Henry? Yes. Um, wow. Dwight York? Dwight York, yes. He is number eight. Thierry Henry is number two. Aguero is number one. Um, Cesar Suarez ain't in there. No. Not, not, um, not Eric Cantona. No. Wow, some of the midfield players. There is no midfield players. One's a winger. No, two are wingers. Van Persie. Yep, number four. Mohamed Salah. Yep, number three. Um, 30, 30 seconds. Oh wow! So how much Ooh. have I got? How much have I got? You've got Henri Aguero, Salah, Van Torres. Persie. No, and you said York. You got five. Drogba. No. Damn. 20 oh, seconds. This is tough. I'm going to be pissed, isn't it? Yeah, you're going to be pissed. This is always difficult, man. Fuck. To be fair, it starts getting a little bit harder. But I thought you'd get nine of them. Yeah, it's over. It's over. <laughs> <laughs> so you got five out of ten this week. So the order is Sergio Aguero. Thierry Henry, Mohamed Salah, Van Persie, Jimmy Floyd Hasselbank, <sighs> Robbie Keane. Now, that's the one I didn't expect you to get. Mm. I didn't expect you to get Robbie Keane. Nicholas Anelka, Dwight York, Son, and Lukaku. This is the ones. So, that's five out of ten for Harry this week. <laughs> He's pissed. That's another episode of Inside Scoop. Look out for next week. Look out for next week. These will make sense. We're out. <laughs>